Hi everybody, welcome back to DayZ and as you can see we are on the mouse, we're at the main airfield and what have we got here? But two of Red Falcon's helis. So what I've done is I've put together a collection of easily addable XMLs that you can add onto your Namalsk uh, server files to spawn in fully working helicopters at various points around Namalsk. Now they're fully working because um, they have all the bits on them so if we look in the back of um, this little hoodlum you'll see that uh, it's got uh, the battery the igniter, the hydraulic hoses, the wiring harness, and the headlamp bulb on it. And in the boot, in the back, in the storage, there is fuel that you can use to fuel it. Also, there's hydraulic fluid, just in case Red Falcon adds the need for that. There's also a spare battery. There's a toolbox that you can repair the helicopter with. Um, and there's also some, some goodies as well. And so there's uh, two here. There's the Hoodlum and the MIL. Um, and if we look at the map, if we go over to the uh, Athena Research Institute, which is down here, so that's the Athena Research Institute just here, we should see. If we go free cam. There we go, there's a bell. Now if you're wondering why I didn't put them on the helicopter pads on top of the uh, buildings in the Malsk, uh, the helicopters wouldn't spawn properly, they get falling over and blowing up, which wasn't any good to anybody. So there's that one there. And then if we turn the free cam off, and then we go to the map, and then we go over to... Um, where is it? BKL01. Hopefully, you should be able to see here. There we go. There's a little bird ready to go. Which is cool. So, go on, get in. Get now. Oh, these zombies are coming after me. <laughs> Let's quickly hide my character. Oh, there's too many of them. There we go. He can stay up here. Right, so there's there's the little bird there. You, you can see over there, actually, there's one that I tried to spawn on top of the helicopter pad, uh, and it blew up. So that's no good to anybody. So let's exit out of here so we can get away from these zombies. And so how do you install them? Well, what you want to do is you want to go over to my GitHub. I'll put a link in the description below the video. Um, and there's over the GitHub, there's um, various um, pictures of uh, the helicopters, so you can so you know where to find them. Um, there's a picture of the locations. There they are on the mask. Um, but most importantly, there's the readme.txt. And the readme.txt is a step-by-step um, -step guide to installing the flight system helis uh, on your server um, and then it goes through and adds different XML snippets now you, you'll be familiar with this sort of thing if you've been modding for a while so for example to start off with you copy the uh, Red Falcon Heli's events editions you insert them into your events.xml and then there is a uh, types.xml editions that you put in and it's all documented and it's all tagged up, so it's easy to do. You've just got to, you've just got to read it and follow it. And then there is the CFG spawnable type for the XML snippets, and that makes the helicopter spawn in with all the bits in them and with the extra bits in the storage. And then finally, the last bit is the um, event spawn. So these are the um, uh, these are the coordinates where the helicopter spawn in. Now, for the purposes of this, these XML spot uh, spawns, I've only done the uh, MI2, the Little Bird, the Belt 429, and the K26. This is a very, very fast-moving mod. Um, Red Falcon um, is adding more and more helicopters all the time. Absolutely fantastic work. It's a fantastic mod. So, you know, as he adds more helicopters, all you need to do is really just, cha just change the names, you know? Just change the names of the events. Um, where were we? Uh, we were over here, weren't we? 
uh, change the names of the events, you know, add in the, the, new, the new names of the new helicopters. I'll probably do update videos with them as well. Um, but it's a great easy way of adding the helicopters to Namalsk um, without having to go through too much hassle because kind of, I've done a lot of the legwork for you. So there we go. Visit the link to the GitHub in the description below this video. I'll put a link to Red Falcon's um, uh, mod on the Steam Workshop, and I'll put a link to his Discord as well. Absolutely fantastic work, and uh, hopefully the video has been useful. If it has been, hit like. If you want to see more, subscribe, and I'll see you again soon.